Hey, this is Barry Trammell again from Dale Sorensen Real Estate. Hey, today we're doing an episode from Royal Palm Point, the fountains of Royal Palm Point. We'll actually do another episode from here and we'll actually show you the fountains. Today we're just looking at this beautiful view of the bridge. Now, the old the Barber Bridge used to be right coming off the point. It's a logical place you can see for because it's a short distance from this point to the other side. So this is where they had an old wooden bridge, a draw bridge. And now today we have this beautiful you know, high bridge that just clears over the Indian River. So the boats can just cut right under it. The sailboats don't have to have a drawbridge drop and the traffic doesn't have to wait. And the great, one of the beautiful things about Vera Beach, we have two bridges and both of them go up uh, over about 50 feet. So then you have to have the drawbridge thing where you have to stop in traffic. I grew up in South Florida. And believe me, I sat a lot of times waiting for a sailboat to go through. But today, hey, I want to have a special topic uh, regarding uh, real estate. And this is going to have to do with insurance, a specific aspect of insurance. And this is uh, what we're talking about is a wind mitigation. When you get your home inspection, you want to get a qualified inspector who can do also wind mitigation. Now, they have to be a certified contractor in this state in order to be able to do uh, the wind mitigation. That's a new law that was passed just a few months ago. So with the wind mitigation, what that's going to do is save you up to $1,000 uh, in your average single family home, that's going to save you $1,000 on your insurance, which is a great savings. That's per year. All right, so $1,000 per year. What we're looking for when you, if you're going to purchase a home, you want to get one that's going to get a good wind mitigation or wind mit value. You're looking for a hip roof, which means the roof line comes down to the wall line at every point in the house. You want at least a 90% hip. There could be a gable, small gable here or there, but you're looking for at least 90% hip roof and you're looking for block home, concrete block home. You're also looking for uh, shutters. The house has to have shutters already existing that are ready and can be set into place uh, already with the anchors set in the wall. And you're also trying to get the um, high impact windows ideally. All right, but the really three important things are hip roof, okay? You want to have the shutters and you want to have a block home. Now there is other, also you can look into the attic and see the strap downs. How is the roof strap down? Another important thing, you have the strap downs and you also have the eaves, the short eaves, so the eaves are not drawn out far from the house. You can catch a lot of wind, or you can get on a lot of uplift on the house or the roof. And just pick it up off the house when you get a hurricane or another strong wind event such as a tornado. So these are really important aspects, very important. Wind mitigation costs you about 100 bucks but it'll save you $1,000 in the first year and continue to save you for years on into perpetuum as you continue to insure your home. So that's something I think is really important. You guys, don't forget that. And don't forget to come to Royal Palm Point. We're going to do another episode where I show you the fountains. And you're going to see this is a great place for kids, a great place just to relax, enjoy the palm trees, and enjoy the beautiful breeze off the Indian River. Have a great day.